Only four more semi-final spots available, and these eight drivers are going to race for it. Welcome back, race fans. We got the last two quarterfinals. Here we go. Driving concept from HFA Motor Club, the number 15 seed, Ego. Driving El Viento, the number 11 seed, Brian Dykema. On the far right, newcomer Matthew Parisi, the number 7 seed, is driving Velocita. And from No Regrets Racing, driving the 2010 Corvette, the blue one, number 2 seed, Andy McBrien. They'll be chased by these two undercover cops as they try to get to the state line. These drivers are battle tested and ready to roll. Let's race. Ego and Dykema in the front row. The group is all bunched up going into turn two. And oh, Ego flips on his roof. He's out. Dykema's leading Parisi into turn three. Now Dykema's pulling away. And it looks like he takes it. Followed by Parisi and the blue cop. And Ego is back there at turn three. Wow, he made it all the way down. And we got a search party out there looking for McBrien. Scoring is seven points for first, five for second, four for third, three for last, and a DNF is a zero. Drivers lose a point for every cop that beats them to the finish line. Top two advance to the next round. So Dykema and Parisi with the early lead and a DNF for Ego and McBrien. McBrien and Ego in the front row. McBrien out early, leading the pack in the turn two. Around turn two, still pulling away. Parisi separating now into turn three, but McBrien takes it easily, followed by Parisi, the blue cop, Ego, and Dykema. So double runner-up finishes, has Parisi in front, one ahead of Dykema, McBrien three back, and Ego six back. Parisi and McBrien in the front row. Parisi, Ego, McBrien, Dykema, single file into turn two. Parisi pulling ahead now. McBrien sideways blocking Ego into turn three. And Parisi's leading. Control issues. And here comes McBrien. Oh, it's a photo finish. Whoa. And uh, we lost Dykema back there. Think back there at turn three. But D yeah, Dykema's off the track at turn three. And wow, this is as close as it gets. McBrien in the blue vet just barely beats out Parisi. And that's a huge win for McBrien. Now one behind Parisi. Ego and Dykema further back. They'll need a lot of help to make it through. Dykema and Parisi in the front row. And their group is all jammed up going into turn two. Out of turn two, Dykema, Parisi, McBrien all heading into turn three. And whoo, Parisi flies off the track, taking Ego with him. Whoa, Dykema's all alone, followed by McBrien. And uh, wow, there is uh, Parisi on his roof. And back there, there's Ego off the track. So Dykema's win moves him a point past Parisi. He'll join McBrien in the semifinals. And we'll say goodbye to Ego and Parisi. Driving Sky Dome from Big Bishop Racing, the number 16 seed, Derek Hudson. Driving Burlesque from Lone Star DRC, the number 12 seed, Greg Hearn. Number 8 seed, Annie Crowhurst from Queen Bee Racing is driving the Corvette Convertible. And driving what for two from Riley's Rally DRC, the number one seed, Mark Taylor. Hudson and Hearn in the front row. Hearn, Crowhurst, Green Cop, single file into turn two. Out of turn two, Hearn sideways, Crowhurst rams him in the rear. Green Cop coming up, turn three. Crowhurst bearing down, but can't close the gap, and Hearn takes it. Followed by Hudson, third, and Taylor, fourth. Hearn and Crowhurst out front. Hudson and Taylor, third and fourth. No DNFs. Taylor and Hudson in the front row. And Taylor takes off going into turn two. Crowhurst sideways blocking the pack. And Taylor's flying out of camera range. Looks like he'll take it by a mile. And then here comes the blue cop. And Hearn barely beats out Hudson for a second. And we lost Crowhurst somewhere. I think we lost Crowhurst back at turn three. Let's see. See if we can get some footage of that. And yes, Crowhurst came off the track at turn three. So Taylor blows the field away and moves into second behind Hearn. Hudson and Crowhurst trailing at the halfway point. Crowhurst and Taylor in the front row. Crowhurst and Taylor battling for position into turn two. Hearn joins the party. Now Crowhurst pulling away with Taylor bearing down into turn three. But Crowhurst is holding position and she sidewinders across the finish line. Hearn in third. And 
Hudson? Wow! Oh, Hudson got caught in a blockade by the Popo. So her and Taylor Crowhurst caught in a tight battle. Two of these will advance. Unfortunately, Hudson doesn't have the points. He'll be racing this next lap for pride. Hearn and Crowhurst in the front row. And Hearn floors it, catching the group off guard into turn two. He's still accelerating. Crowhurst is out. Hudson's a distant second into turn three. But Hearn, like a fastball right down the middle, he takes it. Hudson's in second. Taylor's coming third. And I know Crowhurst, we lost Crowhurst back there. Oh, she got a ticket at turn two. Green Cop got her. So Hearn and Taylor advance by a pretty good margin. And we say goodbye to Crowhurst and Hudson. And we close out the Level Up Club by welcoming Brian Dykema, Andy McBrien, Greg Hearn, and Mark Taylor. We'll see you in the semifinals. And we want to see you in the semifinals too, race fans. Click like and subscribe for immediate updates. Check us out on Facebook at Slingshot360, Diecast Racing. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you at the races.